Hello, sports fan. It's me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke. And today I'm here with game four of the 77 Dodgers and the 87 Giants. Now, unless you do not remember, uh, the Giants are up two games to one right now in the series, and they could put it away with a win in this game. And they will have um, out on the mound today for them, Kelly Downs. Kelly Downs will be pitching for the Giants. They might have gone back to the game one starter if they weren't up two games to one, but they have decided that they are playing with house money here. They only need one more win in the next two games to advance to the next round. So they will go with Downs. And that having been said, we will start the game. There is a lineup change from the lineup uh, previously for the Giants. And I say that because obviously the Giants would be in the field right now. And so you can see at third base, or maybe you can't because you can't. This is Stratomatic. But at third base will be Matt Williams playing for the Giants instead of... Um, Ah, uh, man, who was it that was playing for them? Let's see. Forget his name. Spire, Chris Spire. And actually, Chris Spire was great uh, so far in this. He's been great so far in the series. But Matt Williams is a better defensive third baseman. So they're going to go with him, and they're going to see how that plays out for them. So at the plate is Bill Russell. Bill Russell on the series. He's the first uh, L.A. batter against Kelly Downs. On the series, he is 8 for 11 with 4 RBIs. And he gets a 6-6, six, six, which is a fly ball to right field. One away, and we are underway here. Davey Lopes, he comes into this game 5 for 13 with two stolen bases. And he walks, and you have to imagine he's probably going to try for another stolen base right here. And he will. And that's a 19. He's going to be gunned. Because uh, in the uh, uh, in the basic game, which I am playing, even though Brenly is a catcher four, he still gets uh, a negative arm for that. So there's two outs. And Lopes is caught stealing. And that brings up Dusty Baker. And he could say 5-6, which is a ground ball to the second baseman. That's Robbie Thompson. Robbie Thompson is a 2. And that's a 17, probably going to be an out. And it is. And Dusty Baker came into this uh, game 3 for 16. So he's not helping himself out there much. And L.A. comes away with no runs in the first inning. We go to the bottom of the first in a scoreless game and going out to the mound this game for the LA Dodgers will be Burt Hooten and he is making his first uh, start of the series. Don Sutton started the series as the first Dodgers pitcher uh, but they had decided they needed to uh, stretch it out a little bit so Burt Hooten will be on the mound in this game and Rob Thompson leads off. He is got a 1-6 which is a double one to 15 and that is a double Robbie Thompson greets Hooten with a double to lead it off and on the series he's only two for ten but he has walked five times so his on base percentage is quite good batting average not so much Jose Uribe is up he gets a 6-10 which is a fly ball to left one away and that brings up Will the Thrill Clark, he gets a 2-10, which is a home run. Two-run home run for Will Clark. And that's just going to add to the uh, long resume for Will Clark. And he also came into this game 4 for 13 with two doubles and a homer. So that's his second home run of the series. And uh, the Giants take a big early 2-0 lead and Kevin Mitchell's up with one down and he gets a 2-8 which is a strikeout that's two away 
first strikeout of the game, and the, obviously the first strikeout for uh, Bert Hooten. And with two down, that brings up Candy Maldonado. And he gets a 5-11, which is a ground ball to the pitcher, hit back to Hooten. He is a three defensively, and that's a 10, which is an out. And so Maldonado is out. And he came into the game 0 for 14, and he continues that um, terrible stretch for him. He is in a real funk, now 0 for 15. But San Francisco did come away with two runs. And we go to the top of the second. Remember, if LA loses this game, that's it, and the Giants would go on to the next round. Reggie Smith gets a 3-6, which is a strikeout. Reggie Smith not. Uh, doing all that great in this series. 4 for 15 with an RBI. That brings up Ron Say, the Penguin. He gets a 1-4, which is a home run. So Ron Say goes deep and makes the game really close now. 2-1. to one. That's the first hit allowed by Downs. And Say came in 3 for 14 with a homer and an RBI, and so now he has two homers and two RBIs. And Steve Garvey steps up. He's got a 3-7, which is a ground ball third base, two away. And that brings up Rick Monday Monday, and he gets a ground ball to the third baseman, and he is out. But L.A. does strike for one. They're, they need to keep it close. They don't want to let this get too far away from them. And Jeffrey Leonard is going to greet Hooten as the first uh, San Francisco batter in the bottom of the second. And he gets a home run, one or a double. And that's going to be a double. So Jeffrey Leonard ripping a hit. He hasn't had the greatest of series. Is two for 13 with two doubles, so that's his third double on the series. And runner at second with no outs. Chili Davis up. He gets a 6-10. That is a fly ball to left. One away. Bob Brenly steps up with one away. And he gets a 3-8, which is a single. And that is, that's, um, who is it? Leonard. 1-16 running. They're going to send him. And that's a 4, so I'm sure he scores. So Bob Brenly with the uh, RBI, and actually Brenly is having a great series. He he comes in four for ten, now five for eleven, and he has an RBI there. And so the Giants take a three to one lead, and let's see, yep. And with a man at first and one down, that brings up Matt Williams. Now, Matt Williams hadn't played previously, first of all, because he had fewer at-bats than Spire that season, but also because he hit 188 that year. But here he is with a 4-11, which is a fly ball to left. That's Dusty Baker, and he's a 2. And that's going to be a nine. That's not good. That's going to be bad. Very bad for the Dodgers. That's a double two. So with his first at bat of the series, Matt Williams hits a double. And the, Gi the Giants are really in business here. The Dodgers, with Robbie Thompson up, they are going to play the infield in. And that's a two six, which is a strikeout. And so now the infield will go back. Second strikeout for Hooten, and that brings up Uribe. And Uribe gets a 3-12, which is a ground ball second base. And he is out. The Giants only get the one run, but they do take a they do extend their lead back to two runs by the score of three to one, top of the third. Up steps Lee Lacey, and he gets a 2-9. He strikes out. 
He, coming into the series, Lacey was 3 for 12. That brings up Jaeger. Now, Jaeger has had a great series. He's two for, that, the two seven is a roll of two seven is a single. And he has a hit. And he came into this game six for 12 with a double and an RBI. So he has really been scalding hot. Bill Russell's up. He gets a five three. That is a ground ball to the shortstop. He's a one. That's Uribe. And that is probably gonna be a double play. And it is a double play. There's two down. Russell out. And that brings up Davy Lopes. And Davy Lopes gets a 4 8, which is a single. Davy Lopes again is aboard. He was gunned last time trying to steal, but he's going to try it again. And this time he makes it. He does steal a base. That's the third base stolen for him in the series. And now he's at second with two down and Dusty Baker up. And that's a 5-7, which is a strikeout. Third strikeout for Kelly Downs. No runs come across for L.A. in the third. We go to the bottom of the third with L.A. losing 3-1. And Will the Thrill Clark up, homered last time. He gets a 6-4 this time, just misses one there. It's a fly ball center field. One down. Kevin Mitchell gets a 5-8, which is a strikeout, two away. Third strikeout for Hooten. And Maldonado's up, and that's a 5-7, which is a triple one or a single. That's going to be a single. So Maldonado getting a hit, and I believe that's his first hit, right? Yes, it is. First hit of the series for him. And Leonard steps up. He gets a 6-9, which is a strikeout. No runs. That's the first zero inning for San Francisco as they, they get none in the third, and we go to the top of the fourth. L.A. needing two runs to tie. They're down 3-1. Reggie Smith up. He gets a 2-9, which is a walk. That brings up Ron Say, the Penguin. He gets a 1-8. That's a walk. So some control problems here for Kelly Downs. And that brings up Steve Garvey. He gets a 5-6, which is a ground ball second baseman. He's a 2. That's Robbie Thompson. And that is a 5. Probably a double play. And it is. So that uh, moves Say, or no, Reggie Smith. Reggie Smith moves Reggie Smith over to third with 2 down. And Monday up. And he gets a 1-7, which is a walk. So Kelly Downs is struggling here in the uh, fourth inning with his control. And that brings up Lee Lacey. And he gets a 4-4, which is a catcher card X. Bob Brenly is a 4. That is a 7. 7-4 seven at catcher is... Safe at first on Errored Dribbler. So that brings in a run for L.A. on an error by Bob Brenly. Uh, and it could, it could end up being a costly one. We'll see. And Steve Yeager's up. Of course, he's scalding hot, but right there he's out. He grounds out to the shortstop. But L.A. does... Sneak another run across, and so it's 3-2 San Francisco as we go to the bottom of the fourth. Chili Davis up. He gets a 5-9. That is a strikeout. Bob Brenly up. He gets a 3-4. That's a walk. So he's trying to atone for his... Pretty costly, possibly very costly air. 
That's the first walk, though, by Hooten. Matt Williams is up. He gets a 6-9, and that is a strikeout. Two away. And Hooten has struck out six guys. And that brings up Rob Thompson. He gets a 1-5, which is a triple 1-8 to eight or a double. This could be big. And it is a double. So, Robbie Thompson, two for three. They aren't going to try to score the runner. And Uribe comes up, and he gets a 2-8, which is a ground ball shortstop. So the Giants come close, but they don't get a run there. We go to the top of the fifth. It's 3-2, San Francisco leading. And Bill Russell's at the plate. And he gets a 6-7, which is a walk. Davey Lopes is up. He gets a 5-9, which is a triple 1-2 to two or a single double asterisk. And that's going to be a single double asterisk. So Davey Lopes with a, with a big hit. And only one out here. I believe there's only one out. Yeah. So, um... Or is there? Anyway, they're gonna. The Giants are gonna be looking for another pitcher because Downs is definitely struggling here. For the Giants, he has made an appearance uh, in this series already. The Giants are gonna play the infield back though. With Baker up, and he gets a four-seven. Which is a strikeout. Two away. And now definitely the infield is back. And that brings up Reggie Smith. And he gets a 2-5, which is a three-run home run. Reggie Smith goes deep and gives the uh, Dodgers the lead. And now they have a 4-3 lead. It looked, it started out looking pretty bad for them, but now it's, it, things are looking up. They got a 6-3. That is a ground ball to the first baseman. That is Will Clark. He is a 2. That's a 15, probably an out. And it is. So Ron Say is out. But the Dodgers get 3 in the 5th. And they take a five, uh, five, no, yeah, they get a, it's, yeah, they're ahead by more than that. It's a, yeah, that's what it looks like. Five, three lead, not just four, three. So we go to the bottom of the fifth. The Giants are now down by two. And Will Clark is up. He gets a three, five, which is a walk. Second walk, only issued by Hooten. Kevin Mitchell up. He gets a 5-6. That's a strikeout. One away. Seven strikeouts for Hooten. He is, he's whiffing people left and right. Candy Maldonado comes up. Gets a 6-6. Six, six. That's a single one to 15. That's an out, though. It's going to be a line out to second. And that brings up Jeff Leonard. And he gets a 4-7, which is a fly ball to right field. And no runs come in for the Giants. And you know what? Who is coming in for the Giants is going to be Don Robinson. Kelly Downs only pitches five innings. And he's going to turn it over to Robinson. In 1987, Robinson was 11 and 7. 
pitched 108 innings all in relief so you know that he can go a while. And that brings up Steve Garvey to lead off against him opening the sixth inning. And he gets a 1-8, which is a home run. Gone. Steve Garvey out of here. And that is apparently his first home run of the series. He greets Robinson with the homer. And uh, the Dodgers extend their lead. Rick Monday comes up. He gets a 4-7, which is a strikeout. One away. That brings up Lee Lacey. He gets a 4-3. That's a, ground, a fly ball to right. The right fielder for the Dodger. Or, or wait a minute. No, 4-3. That's a ground ball to the pitcher, and that's Robinson. Doesn't have the rating on the card, so he is considered to be a two, which is a one base error. Lacey getting on by an error. So one down, one on. Jaeger up, he gets a two eight, which is a double one to three single level asterisk. That's gonna be a single double asterisk. And Jaeger continues to be hitting on a torrid pace here. He's two for three in this game, came in six for 12. Runners are at the corners with one down and Russell up, and that's a six, nine. And that's gonna be a walk to load the bases. So Robinson was not the solution, or at least he wasn't a good one. And that brings up Davy Lopes, and he gets a three, seven, which is a strikeout. Well, yeah, I don't know. So base is juiced, two down, Dusty Baker up, and that's going to be a fly ball to center field. Baker is out in his column. But the Giants did get a run, or the Dodgers, excuse me, did get a run, and so it's now 6-3. The Giants down by three, and coming to the, to the plate in the uh, bottom of the sixth. Against Hooten, who has pitched... Well enough to at least stay out there for the sixth. Chili Davis is up. He gets a 6-4. That's going to be a fly ball. Center field one away. Bob Brenly up. He gets a 4-10. That is a ground ball third base. That's say he's a two at third. And that, that is going to be an out, I believe. And it is. Friendly down. And that brings up Matt Williams. Matt Williams gets a 4-2. That's a line out to shortstop. We go to the top of the seventh. Robinson hopefully is over his, his uh, issues from the uh, from last inning. But we'll see. Reggie Smith is up. He gets a 1-9. That's a walk. So apparently he isn't. Ron Say is up. He gets a 1-7, which is a single 1-8. to eight. That is going to be a single. And Robinson is already in trouble. They were hoping to get at least a couple of innings out of him. But I don't know that that's going to happen. And now Atley Hammaker is up in the Giants bullpen. Steve Garvey is up at the plate. He gets a 5-7, which is a strikeout. One away. He always seems to come up with that key strikeout right when he needs it. And he needed it there. Rick Monday comes up. He gets a 5-9. That's a ground ball second base C. That moves runners for L.A. to second and third, but there's now two down. And Lee Lacey's up. He gets a 3-8, which is a ground ball shortstop. So, again, he wriggles off the hook. He did give up the opening home run, the opening batter home run in the sixth. And then he loaded the bases, but he stopped everybody from scoring. And now in the seventh, he also seems to get out of that. It really did. And we go to the bottom of the seventh with the Giants still down by three. 
by the score of six to three. And at the plate against Hooten, who's pitching his seventh inning here. Four or five is a ground ball second base. See, he is out. Rob Thompson out. Uribe's up. He gets a 2-7, which is a strikeout. Eighth strikeout for Hooten. And Will Clark up, and he gets a 5-8, which is a strikeout. Ninth strikeout for Hooten. Got to believe they're going to stick with him because they they don't know. I mean, the, even if they win this game, the next game would be the winner-take-all game, and they want the whole bullpen fresh and ready for that. So L.A. comes up, and that's going to be it for Robinson. He's only going to pitch two, and they're going to go to Adley Hammer. find Adley Hammaker. I know he's in here. There he is. So Adley Hammaker walks out to the mound and uh, top of the eighth up steps Steve Yeager. 6-7. That's a ground ball to second. The second baseman is a two. That's Robbie Thompson. 19 and two is an out. One, one away. Trying to cool Jaeger off has been an uphill battle for the Giant pitching. Bill Russell gets a 4-11, which is a ground ball to the shortstop. The shortstop is Uribe. He's a 1. That's going to be an out. And that brings up Davey Lopes. And he gets a 6-6. And that's a fly ball to the left fielder. And... They get out of the eighth. Uh, Atley Hammaker actually pitching a very impressive eighth inning. Hooten again out to the mound, pitching the eighth. I mean, in uh, 1977, he pitched 223 innings. So you got to believe this is nothing new for him. Um, Kevin Mitchell is up. 3 7, that's a single. So Kevin Mitchell's trying to start him out here. Candy Maldonado gets a 1-5, which is a single. And now they're going to, the uh, Dodgers are going to look at the bullpen. Because... And Jeffrey Leonard's up at the plate. No outs. And there's a 2-6, which is a ground ball double play. So now there's two outs and a man at third. That might have bought um, a complete game effort for uh, Hooten, but we'll see. Chili Davis is up. He gets a 5-10. That's a catcher card. The catcher is Jaeger. He's a 1. That is a 10. 10-1 ten and one is an out on dribbler. So that is it. Chili Davis gets an out. And uh, San Francisco, they, it looked like they started off that inning really well, but they didn't end up getting any runs, and they needed at least one, you would have to think, right there. Top of the ninth, Dusty Baker is up. He gets a 2-11, which is a single. First hit allowed by Hammaker. And that brings up Reggie Smith. 112, it's fly ball A. So that moves the runner to second. But there is an out. And that was a fly ball. Um, let's see. That was a fly ball to right. Ron Say is up. That's a 3 5, which is a strikeout, two away. Garvey is up, and that's a 4-10. 4-10 is a walk. So Garvey works a walk. And 
and that brings up Rick Monday Monday, and that's going to be a home run one to six, or a double. That's a home run, three run home run, and you got to believe Monday has just put this game to bed. The Giants pitching just was not very sharp this game. And that brings up Lee Lacey. And he gets a 5-8, which is a strikeout. And I would hesitate to say that, um, you know, the Giants don't have any chance of coming back, but um, they probably don't. Bob Brenly is up. Hooten definitely is going back out there. That's a 2-8, which is a double one to 17. So that's a, a leadoff double by Brenly. And with uh, Matt Williams up, they're going to bring a pinch hitter out, and that's going to be... Uh, I'll know when I see him. That's going to be Mike Aldrete. So, pinch hitter, Mike Aldrete. No outs. The Giants trying. They're trying. And that's a 5-8, which is a strikeout. One away. Tenth strikeout for Hooten. Matt, or not Matt Williams, uh, but Robbie Thompson. Is a, gets a 1-6, which is a double 1-15. to 15. That's going to score a run. And it does. And it's a double. Tenth hit given up by Hooten. Uribe's up. That's a 6-5. That's a home run 1-5 to five or a double. We're going to roll that properly. And that's a double. And that's going to be it for Hooten. Um, and they bring in Charlie Huff. So Hooten pitches, I don't think there, is there any out? There is, there's one out. So Hooten pitches eight and a third. Man at second, Will Clark up. He gets a five, eight. That's a strikeout, two away. And up steps Kevin Mitchell. And he gets a 110, which is a pop out to third. So the Giants do lose game four by the score of nine to. Uh, and the Giants got how many runs there? They got two, right? Yeah. So the final score was 9-5 in this game. That means there will be a game 5, a deciding game 5. And I believe the starters in that game are going to be Mike Kruko against Don Sutton. You don't want to miss that. We knew this series was going to be a good series, and that's exactly how it's shaped up to be. But that's going to be it for me for right now. Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.